climate change is something that is a big impact for us. It used to be that their customers had two choices. There was gasoline, there was diesel. So when I talk to customers about alternative fuels, the most common question I get is, why? There are three prime drivers that people look for alternative fuels. It reduces their carbon footprint, dependence on foreign oil, costs less. What is the next step to take? What we've realized at Ford is that we're unlikely to have one single solution. The best solution is to make sure that you match the right fuel up to the right job. Which technology makes the most sense for me? When we look at electric vehicles, the Focus Electric has a range of 76 miles, which means that if you know the route that you're taking every day, then an electric car makes a lot of sense. If you have someone who spends a lot of time driving on highways or going between cities, then a hybrid makes more sense because you aren't carrying around the extra weight of that battery that's not being used very often. When we talk about alternative fuels for larger vehicles at Ford, the dominant solution we have is natural gas or propane. One of the big benefits of running natural gas from an environmental standpoint is the chemical composition of natural gas is substantially simpler than the chemical composition of diesel or gasoline. The star of the show of our power of choice engines for F-150 is the EcoBoost 3.5 liter. This engine gives you the power of a V8 but the fuel economy of a V6. The engine's lighter so the truck doesn't have to work as hard and it gives you the hauling capacity, the towing capacity, all the things that a commercial customer needs in an F-Series truck with the fuel economy of a V6, so it's easy on your pocketbook. We're putting together vehicles in a way that is maximizing what the customer is interested in, which is improving their fuel economy, which equates directly to reducing their carbon footprint. The less fuel you use, the less carbon you emit. I'm confident enough in Ford's approach that when it comes down to people's purchase decisions, there'll be a blue oval on the front of the vehicle they buy.